Chimpanzee versus baboon. Who would win in a fight? The first rule of Animal Fight Club is that it must be discussed in great grisly detail. The second rule is that there can only be one winner. Today's face-off features two of Africa's most successful primates, animals that cling to survival as fiercely as they cling to tree branches. In the red corner, a lovable critter that has starred in countless experiments, shares 99% of our DNA sequence, and has even gone to space. In the blue corner, a feisty grappler that can evade the jaws of Africa's meanest predators and invade your hotel room. Please give a rousing animal welcome to today's combatants, the chimpanzee and the baboon. The chimpanzee, aka pantroglodytes, is a primate in the hominidae family, much like us human beings. Also known as chimps, they are perhaps our most famous relative and are featured in countless human endeavors in science, entertainment, and animal education. There are four subspecies, mainly differentiated by their native regions. There is the central chimpanzee, pantroglodytes troglodytes, which is the most famous subspecies. We also have the Western chimp, aka Pantroglodytes verus, native to West African countries like the Ivory Coast, and the Eastern chimp, Pantroglodytes schweinfurti, the most common subspecies. Then there is the rarer Nigeria Cameroon chimp. Primatologists are still debating the status of a potential fifth subspecies, the Southeastern chimpanzee, Pantroglodytes marigensis. However, the International Union for Conservation of Nature UCN, has yet to recognize it as a separate species. Chimpanzees are fairly large primates, and all subspecies have sexual dimorphism, particularly when it comes to size. Male chimps are bigger, with weight ranging from 85 to 160 pounds. Females weigh between 60 and 110 pounds. Height for adults ranges from 4 to 5 and a half feet, with males usually being taller. Chimpanzees can live to very old ages, but factors in the wild often cut life short. On average, chimps rarely get past 12 years in the wild. However, they can easily grow past 50 in captivity. The oldest recorded chimp, Little Mama, reached 70 years of age before she died. Chimpanzees are highly intelligent and social animals. They live in groups of varying sizes, from 5 to 10 individuals on the small side to up to 150 individuals on the larger end. Groups are generally dominated by males, but all female mini-groupings may occur. Dominant males are the most aggressive, engaging in loud warnings, displays of fangs, and even mock charges. Physical violence is quite rare, but may be used to get one's point across. The role of these males is to set up and defend territorial boundaries, protect from predators, father young, and lead the group to feeding grounds. Chimps are omnivorous, but the bulk of their diet consists of fruit. They will also eat buds, seeds, leaves, pith, and flowers. Chimps also love eating meat and often establish hunting parties to go after prey in their woodland and savanna homelands. They are opportunistic predators, going after monkeys, birds, and small antelopes. They will also go after birds' eggs, insects, and honey. They are both tree-dwelling and adept to life on the ground. Renowned tool users, chimps often build nests in the trees for sleeping, a particularly favored pastime. All chimpanzee species are native to tropical and subtropical woodlands and savannas of Africa. Baboons, like chimps, are primates whose name actually refers to several subspecies. Unlike chimps, though, baboons are not hominids, aka great apes. Instead, they belong to the Cercopithecidae family, which is home to many Old World monkeys. Baboons all belong to the Papio genus, which has six species. There is the olive baboon, Papio anubis, Chachma baboon, Papio ursinus, Kinda baboon, Papio kindai, Yellow baboon, Papio cynocephalus, and Guinea baboon, Papio papio. These five species are often referred to as savanna baboons due to their habitat, savannas and sparse woodlands. The last species, the Hamadrius baboons, Papio Hamadrius, dwells in more mountainous and rocky areas than its cousins. However, all baboon species have a largely similar modus operandi. Baboons spend most of their time on the ground, foraging for food and keeping their eyes peeled for danger. However, they are also expert tree climbers. 
Depending on the species, baboons range between 30 to 90 pounds, with males being larger than females. The chachma is the larger species and the kinder is the smallest. Excluding the tail, they range between 20 inches and 47 inches in length. Tails can be up to 28 inches long. They tend to live in groups known as troops, which vary in size due to different circumstances. Troops are dominated by males who have strict hierarchies. Dominant males within troops tend to have larger harems and, by extension, more young than subordinate males. Of course, baboons have been known to roll solo on occasion, but this is fairly rare. Usually males in between troops might move this way in a bid to find better mating opportunities elsewhere. However, they understand that life in a troop is their best bet of surviving Africa's tough wildlands. Highly adaptable, baboons range from the tip of the South African Cape all the way to the southern tips of the Sahara. They are highly intelligent animals that display incredible problem-solving techniques. Baboons have even learned to coexist with humans better than most primates in Africa. They have been known to raid human settlements in rural areas for crops and livestock. Farmers often set traps, get guns, and train vicious guard dogs to deal with pesky baboons, but the crafty primates are a tough opponent to beat. In urban areas, baboons are renowned trash raiders and can even break into homes to raid fridges and pantries. Some tourists have even been shocked to find baboons following them back to their cars after shopping for groceries. A kid in sunny South Africa was once left in tears after a sweet-toothed baboon relieved him of his ice cream cone. Also like chimpanzees, baboons are highly omnivorous. It could even be argued that they are even less fussy than chimps, eating pretty much anything humans would eat and much more. Different species will consume more of one thing than another because of the environment, but they will all eat the same kind of food. They love fruits, nuts, pith, flowers, insects, and meat. They will even raid your kitchen for cereal, potatoes, corn, candy, and ice cream. If a baboon finds food in or near your house, he or she will be back again with more baboons. Weapons and Strategy Despite their cute, lovable faces and high trainability into loving pets, chimpanzees are actually very vicious animals. They are incredibly strong and surprisingly quick, enough to do serious damage or even kill a human. They also have deadly canines and opposable thumbs to help them wrestle victims, as well as a top speed of 25 miles per hour that reduces chances of escape. In fact, there have been over 20 documented chimp attacks in Uganda alone. There is the tragic tale of Travis, a trained actor chimpanzee who had done gigs for Pepsi and even the Maury Povich show. One day, while his owner had a friend over, Travis went berserk on their guest. The then 55-year-old Charla Nash picked up a toy doll Travis was particularly fond of, which set the chimp off in a blind rage that only ended when police put four bullets in him. Charla lost nine fingers, a lip, her nose, as well as her eyes, in an attack that left everyone, including the hospital staff, requiring counseling. Blinded for life, Charla was put forward as a potential face transplant candidate. Baboons are also armed with serious canines that could seriously injure a person. They have been known to maim dogs, and in their numbers, they have done serious damage to leopards, their chief nemesis. Like chimps, they also have opposable thumbs that aid with grip. Baboons also pack a swift slap that may confuse the recipient. Baboons are also rapid animals, reportedly reaching speeds of nearly 30 miles per hour. Additionally, they have adapted decent night vision to help them keep an eye out for marauding leopards. Ultimately, in their natural environment, chimps and baboons rely on their groupings. They signal for danger through a number of cries, and they attack potential threats with surprising levels of cohesion and teamwork. Who would win? In a one-on-one -on -one bout, it's hard to look past the chimpanzee given their sheer aggression levels. While a baboon will fight hard if cornered, they do not have a lot of offensive aggression. Baboons are smart enough to want to avoid unnecessary injury, which could be a death sentence in their environment. Another factor in a chimp's favor is size. They can be as much as twice the size of baboons, giving them major weight, reach, and strength advantages. Furthermore, the chimp's refined monkey hunting skills 
make the baboon more of a menu item than a noteworthy opponent.